Mr. Kamalas and welcome to NDTV. Thank so, you. Uh, I have been watching some of your interviews. One place you said this is a prequel and a sequel. What does that mean? Uh, well, um, we set up uh, a story in right. the first version right. where there were a lot of intrigues right. and it kept the pace of the film. Mm. There were certain unanswered mm. questions, right. but audience didn't pause to uh, ask those questions. But that doesn't mean we are n not liable to answer them. You will answer them. So that's where the prequel comes. Right. And the sequel is the logical continuation right. and conclusion right. of this. So it will continue from there, but it will also take you to the unanswered to, question. Uh, to the source, source of the Nati. Right. Yeah. So uh, you direct, you act and you produce. At, on some days on a set, do you feel it could have been easier if you had a director and you could concentrate on acting or you think it's great to have that control so that you can make exactly what you want it's uh, it, it it's like uh, say having a scribe mm -hmm. and writing yourself mm -hmm. right some right. people are comfortable some people are comfortable telling poems Correct. rather than writing them right. it comes to them that way right. it's an individual style and right. uh, i'm used to it, used to it uh, because i grew step by step right. into various uh, faculties in yeah. cinema right so uh, it, it it was not like i was training myself so. Right. So today's audience is watching a lot of international web shows, movies. So their expectation with quality is really high production. How do you keep? How do you up the game every time? I am that audience. Yeah. You are that audience as well. Okay. So, but but you know, is there an effort to get some technical support? To to do you do you watch these things? Do you, do you yeah, I, I do. I'm a film buff. Yeah, yeah. So I I. Uh, at least last year I had an accident, so right. I was watching about uh, uh, 30 to 40 films a month. Oh, wow, that's amazing. So that, that's uh, <laughs> twice daily, right. like, it's like exercise for me. Right. And uh, various kinds, and, uh, and we, I trained uh, whenever uh, mm. I had uh, opportunity, not only mm. in Indian classical arts, but mm. also went to Hollywood. I trained in screenwriting, okay. I trained uh, a bit of uh, ma many workshops I've had. Oh, okay. This all through the course of uh, my films for the cool. past 30 years I've been training in prosthetic makeup with the Michael Westmore. So Every that's year. how as an actor also you keep uh, working on your craft as well yes. because it's a busy thing. Also how do, I mean I always wanted to ask you, how do actors better their craft by just watching? I, I, I think acting is ceasing to do that right. deliberately <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> that's yeah. what that's what acting is not right. acting right. for which you'll have to think about acting mm. not act about act not act about acting that's true so is there enough creative freedom for all for filmmakers like yourself to make what you want no there's never been that even for say, from the times of uh, uh, Homer to now, uh, uh, I mean, uh, scribes, writers, thespians, they all found it difficult. Right. But uh, that's the difficulty that makes them uh, innovative, I guess. But in 2018, shouldn't it, shouldn't it be easier by now? Did, you, ex did you expect it to become to better? It is easier to compared to uh, what uh, uh, Flaherty mm. did as mm. a, a documentary filmmaker. Right. Documentary filmmaker is so easy. Right. The cameras are so light. Mm. The editing is so simple. Right. Uh, and uh, gone are the days when uh, uh, Attenborough goes to Africa, <laughs> shoots a film and loses the footage. Right, right, right. Yeah. yeah, all those things are gone. It's, it's becoming easier and easier, but the onus and the responsibility mm. of sensitizing the society right. is more and more. Right. It, it, just because it's simple, mm. it doesn't mean you have a less of a responsibility. Absolutely. Is there a web show that you got hooked onto? Because that's what apparently everybody is watching nowadays. Oh, a well, long, long time back. Even before the web shows came into fashion, mm. I watched Keselowski Decalogue. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. Uh, oh, uh, yeah. Uh, Three Colors Blue. Right. And uh, uh, so it's nothing oh, new. It's exactly. only. So your film have always had a political tone, be it Hey Ram or any film till now. Is that your space that you enjoy also personally watching as a viewer? Um, yes, um, not only that, but yeah. the, the, a, a statement uh, 
uh, state of life mm. uh, and commenting on it. Right. Everybody loves doing it. Why not filmmakers? Of course, why not filmmakers? So it's a uh, now that you'll get busy in politics, it's bad news for people like me who are film journalists. Will we get to meet you much less, or we expect to meet you quite often? I like films. I, I might still write about it, talk about it, yeah. and probably uh, we, we should all arrange film festivals around the country. Right. So we will get to meet private you. private film festivals, yeah. which will keep happening. But you think work, film work will be less because obviously you're going to be busy with politics. Yes, but my company will continue doing work and increase its pace of production. On screen? On screen, yes. You will see me, but not as an actor, I guess. So when the first film came out, it got into enough trouble. You came out, you, you explained things, uh, it was portrayed in a certain way, you went to the court. Um, is there anything that you think at this point you want to tell the audience? There's, is there anything in the film you feel anyone, any community, religion will get offended? I, I think like, maybe in this part of India I might have to explain. <laughs> but South, they knew that it was a tyrannical treachery by politicians Absolutely, who yeah. walked into it and messed up the, mm. I mean, uh, stirred the soup which was cooking pretty well on its own. So they stirred the soup at a time when you were a producer. Today, you're, when your film is releasing, you are a party president, you have a political party, you're expecting more trouble? No, because uh, now they, I'm talking to peers. Right. So right. I'm not talking to uh, the rulers right. now. Right. Okay. So you and your friend Rajni Kant, people say, if two of you come together, you all will be like the Avengers, unbeatable. Have you given it a thought? No, that's uh, that's an easy uh, epiphany, but uh, it has to happen. We will right. we'll have to work carefully on that. Right. Yes, if if we do come together, it can happen. But then th there are so many things. Mm. Why didn't we do it in film? Because yeah, I, I heard you explain why you all didn't do it. It was a proper there strategy. Might, there might be similar reasons in politics too. Right. We so don't that, know. Right. We so that know. can be the way to go. Oh. Yeah, we don't know really. And Both of us don't. And do you have a vision for the country? What kind of India do you expect? What kind of India do you want? Our constitution is robust. Mm -hmm. We just have to execute it right. properly. Right. And we have been given 70 years mm -hmm. and we've been bumbling about, floundering with some of the greatest minds in, mm -hmm. in politics because we were impeding each other's progress in the name of politics. Right, right. Whereas the idea of polity is to improve the whole lot together. Right. Right. Uh, security for women is still an issue. Mob lynching is suddenly a new issue. Are these stories that you follow and what goes through your mind when you watch any of this? See, these things are events which will suddenly come, happen, not happen. Mm. We have uh, a Raman Raghav, mm. <laughs> mm. a madman going berserk. Right. And then we have rapists, right. we have serial killers. Right. That happens around the world, but that doesn't mean that you you, you you blame society mm -hmm. and then your job is done? Mm -hmm. No, but we will have to go into the very core right. of uh, the, the situation. Right. And I think uh, we, when I say the media and artists are, have an onus on us. Right. Bringing the news is not enough. Mm -hmm. Exposing us is not enough. Blowing the whistle is not enough. Continuing to stay the path is what we need to do. Yeah. So, is there an important role you're looking for yourself in the 2019 elections? Is of course, there is. In, at least in you Tamil Nadu. Some, some no, Tamil Nadu. Nadu. We will try to right. uh, challenge the status quo wow. that is there. Okay. That that's our primary purpose. Mm. And we are not just there to rabble rouse. Mm. We are working on a policy, and uh, we're going to be reading it out very soon. Um, we promised 180 days mm -hmm. and uh, very few uh, days left, probably right. 70 or 80 days. Right. You have a film coming up. We first hope that you have a very safe and nice release and hope it becomes a hit. My last question is, first love would be politics or films? People. People. That's why politics. Great. On that note, thank you very much, sir, for talking to us. Thank, thank you. Sir.